Hey everyone, I'm Julio and this is my beautiful wife Kate. We are a fairly large family that includes four kids, two dogs, and a cat who up until recently had been traveling full time. We started our journey in a 22 foot travel trailer. Yes, you heard that right. We lived in that for about nine months after we sold our house and while we were waiting for our 40 foot school bus to be converted into our new home. We traveled around for about a year and a half before COVID hit. So here we are, renting a home in the New England area and stationary, at least for now. We eventually would love to have our own homestead here and who knows, it may be sooner than later, but one thing is for sure, we will continue to have our bus Isabella and in the meantime we are doing some much needed renovations to make life easier for us when we are living tiny. Thank you for following along in our journeys and this is Isabella the Bus. Hey everybody, Julio here from Isabella the Bus. I have about an hour of sunlight where I can get some work done. I came over as soon as I got off of work and I'm going to try to work on these stairs and see what I can knock out and hopefully I can get a good amount done. I'm going to paint them with Rust-Oleum but before I do that I'm going to size the tiles that I'm going to be putting down which I'm not showing you quite yet. Uh, I'm going to size the flooring that I'm going to be putting down and then I'm going to go ahead and paint. So here we go. For anyone that's curious, the metal does have a different texture to it when I used the rust reformer last week. Um, it almost feels like a primer that's on there, it's just rougher. Uh, it could need, it could use a sanding if I wanted to, but it's just a base coat that's going to be painted over with the rust-oleum and then I'm going to put the tiling over top of that, so I'm not too concerned with the texture of it. Um, but if you're interested, that's kind of what it looks like or feels like right now. Hey everybody, Julio here from Isabella the Bus. I hope everybody's having a great weekend. So today what I am working on at the bus is the next step on the steps. So uh, if you've been following along, you know that I've already cleaned the steps. I already sprayed a rust converter uh, spray over the rusty spots of the steps and I already painted them with the primer of the Rust-Oleum. So now what I'm going to do is start designing slash decorating the steps. 
So my original plan, uh, I don't know how far back you may have been following along, but my original plan was to use some of the leftover flooring that we had from when we did the floor of the bus. Well, once I opened the box, I realized that I actually don't have enough materials to do both the bottom and the back of the stair tread. Uh, so what happened was, and this was just, I just happened to be at Lowe's grabbing something else for the bus, and I came across some vinyl peel and stick tiles that were on clearance. So shout out to Lowe's for that because I picked some of those up really quick. I think they were like 88 cents a tile and those are now going to be the bottom portion of our steps and then I'm still going to use the leftover stair material that I had but that's going to be for the back side of the steps. So I hope it looks as good as my mind envisions uh, but we'll see and I really don't want to have to buy any more products we're trying to reuse kind of what we have um, try not to spend too much money on on these remodeling projects that we're doing so um, yeah let's get to it Hey guys, I just want to apologize. I was running low on camera battery and I didn't realize it. But here's what I've been working on. I got some of my pre-cuts done. And ultimately this is what it's gonna look like before I put the wood back wood paneling up back up on the sides. But I think it's gonna look great.
Hey guys, check it out. All right, everybody, I just got done doing the steps. I think it turned out really good. I'm not completely done. I'm still going to go back over the tiles and grout them. Uh, I love space. They, they are groutable tiles, but they don't have to be grouted, but I, we prefer that look. And so yeah, that's gonna be the next step of those. And then also when I was doing the back of the stair treads, I left a little, I didn't intentionally leave a little bit, but the, the pieces of the vinyl planks that I had weren't tall enough. So I'm gonna have to go back through and add some, some smaller pieces there. And then I'm gonna add the uh, trim to go over each stair tread, uh, probably just an aluminum uh, trim, probably just an aluminum trim that I'm gonna put on there. I'm not quite sure yet. Uh, haven't gotten that far in the design process. That's kind of like last step thing. So, <laughs> and then I have one final touch that I wanna put to make our bus special once we are finally done with the steps. And I am excited to show you all that once we get there, but we're not there quite yet. Um, I also decided, if you've been following along, I took off some of the wainscoting that had been along the sides, and I decided that I'm going to paint it, and then we'll put it back up. So, yeah, that's that's where we're at, and uh, I think it looks great. Keep following along, you'll see the next steps. I was lucky enough to have some great weather today. Not really. <laughs> it was at least sunny out, but it's warm enough for me to be working uh, on the bus, even though with the door open, it's still kind of cold. Uh, but yeah, all is well, and I'm really happy with how it turned out, and then we'll see how much I can get out here before the, the snow and the cold weather hits. Talk to y'all later.